linear equations now see student an equation in which the highest power of the variable is 1 that equation is called as linear equation see equation in which highest power of variable that means variable x y is 1 then the equation is called as linear equation now see student we are going to learn simultaneous equation now see two or more equation in two or more variables having unique set of solutions are called as simultaneous equation see in simultaneous equation you are going to consider two or more than two equation that they contains two or more variables but they have unique set of solution so such equations are called as simultaneous equation solution of simultaneous equation now see student we have to learn how to find the solution of simultaneous equation when the simultaneous equations are satisfied by the same pair of values of two variable that means suppose x and y are the variable and the equation is satisfied by the same pair of values then the such pair of values of variable is called as solution of the given simultaneous equation so in this chapter we are going to study different methods to find the solution of simultaneous equation see the methods of solving linear equations in two variables see we are going to study linear equations in two variables only so first method is graphical method second method is determinant method and we have one more method that we will study later on now first we will start with graphical method to solving the simultaneous linear equation now let's start with question number one solve the following simultaneous equation using graphical method see with the help of graph you have to find the solution of this simultaneous linear equation question number four see now student two equations are given x plus 2y is equals to 5 and y is equals to minus 2x minus 2 now we have to find the solution of this equation with the help of graphical method that means for the first equation x plus 2y is equals to 5 we have to find out graph of this equation you will get one straight line similarly second equation you will have another straight line and point of intersection of both the lines will give you solution of this equation now see to plot the graph of this equation you have to consider minimum three points on this line so x plus 2y is equals to 5 this equation i can write x is equals to mind 5 minus 2y now see student you have to find the coordinate of x and y so let consider the coordinate of x y and then x and y for example suppose first we will consider y is equals to 0 then in this equation you have to substitute y is equals to 0 so x will become 5 minus 2 into 0 that is 0 so x is equals to 5 that means first pair of coordinate is 5 0 now let consider y is equals to 1 so substitute in equation y is equals to 1 so 5 minus 2 into 1 2 5 minus 2 is equals to 3 that means x is 3 so the coordinates become 3 1 then next let consider y is equals to 2 so the coordinate will be 5 minus 2 into 2 is 4 5 minus 4 is 1 so 1 2 so we have this three set of points to plot the graph now our second equation is y is equals to minus 2x minus 2 for that equation let's start with y is x is equals to 0 when x is equals to 0 you will get c y is equals to minus 2 into 0 minus 2 that is minus 2 so 0 minus 2 next 
x is equals to 1 that means y is equals to minus 2 into 1 minus 2 minus 2 into 1 minus 2 minus 2 it will become minus 4 so 1 minus 4 and then next 2 minus 2 into 2 minus 4 minus 4 minus 2 minus 6 so 2 minus 6 so in this way we have the set of coordinates for both the lines so now we can plot the graph of both the lines now see for that on a graph paper you have to draw x axis and y axis perpendicular to each other now see you have to consider all the four coordinate so the axis will be at the center of the graph paper now write the coordinate origin 0 on right hand side 1 2 3 4 5 positive left hand side negative on the upper part of the y axis coordinate are positive and on the lower part it is negative now let's start with the first equation x plus 2y is equals to 5 first we will plot the point 5 0 see 5 x axis and 0 is the coordinate of y so 5 0 is this point next will be 3 1 see 3 on x axis and 1 on y axis so the point will be here this is 3 1 next will be 1 2 on x axis 1 y axis 2 so you will have line like this so this is a graph of equation x plus 2y is equals to 5 you have to write the equation at either end of the line now let's start with the second equation see y is equals to minus 2x minus 2 so first point we have to plot 0 on x axis minus 2 on y so the point will be here 0 minus 2 then 1 minus 4 see this is point 1 on x axis minus 4 on y axis so 1 minus 4 then 2 minus 6 2 on x axis minus 6 on y axis so 2 minus 6 now join all the points you will get line like this right equation y is equals to minus 2x minus 2 now see the point of intersection of both the line this is point of intersection this will give solution of this equation so what are the coordinate of this point c x coordinate is minus 3 and y coordinate is 4 so solution x is equals to minus 3 and y is equals to 4 on this graph paper remember student you have to write the scale see this is the scale 1 centimeter is equals to 1 unit on both the axes the scale is same for both the axes so we have answer minus 3 and 4 Hence, x is equals to minus 3 and y is equals to 4 is the solution of given simultaneous equation. See, in this way, we can find the solution of given simultaneous equation by using graphical method. Now, see one more question. You have to find the solution of this equation by graphical method. See, the equation is 2x plus y is equals to c 6 4 minus 3x upon 4 is equals to y. Now again we have to first find out minimum 3 points to plot the equation line of this equation. So see we can write this equation in this form y is equals to 6 minus 2x. So see you can consider x at 0. So substitute x is equals to 0 you will get 6 minus 2 into 0 that is 6 so first coordinate will be 0 6 then x is equals to 1 so y is equals to 6 minus 2 into 1 so 6 minus 2 that is equals to 4 so 1 4 next consider x is equals to 2 6 minus 2 into 2 4 so 6 minus 4 is 2 so 2 2 so we have three coordinate for this line similarly we can find for the next equation see the next equation is 4 minus 3x upon 4 is equals to y that is y is equals to 4 minus 3x upon 4 now see we can substitute the value first x is equals to 0 4 minus 0 upon 4 4 upon 4 that is equals to 1 
so 0 1 next x is equals to 4 so 4 3 is 12 4 minus 12 minus 8 upon 4 is minus 2 so 4 minus 2 see next you can consider minus 4 minus minus 3 into minus 4 will become plus 12 4 plus 12 16 16 upon 4 is 4 so minus 4 4 now see remember student for x we can consider odd even number so that you will get the value of y in even number only that means it will become easy to plot the point now see we can plot the graph of this both equation in same way you have to consider x axis and y axis perpendicular to each other write the coordinate of the points now first we will start with the equation 2x plus y is equals to c 6 now see the first point 0 6 so see 0 on x axis 6 on y axis See this is the point 0 6 then you have to plot 1 4 see 1 on x axis 4 on y axis and then last point is 2 2. So we can join this point you have a line and the equation of the line is 2x plus y is equals to 6. Now see the second 4 minus 3x upon 4 is equals to y. So first point is 0 y. See first point is 0 1 then 4 minus 2 minus 4 minus 4. See this is point minus 4 4. Then you can take the point 0 1 this is point 0 1 and 4 minus 2. See 4 and minus 2. Now join this. So this is line for equation 4 minus 3x upon 4 is equals to 1. Now see their point of intersection is 4 minus 2 that means this will become solution of given quadrat given simultaneous equation you can write the scale 1 centimeter is equals to 1 unit on both the axis so we can write answer x is equals to 4 and y is equals to minus 2 is the solution of given simultaneous equation